Welcome to jobskillshare.org computer basics to IT professional. In this course we are going to do the first course overview and introduction and in this video we will cover all of these sections and we are going to basically briefly talk about these sections. So the first thing you need to do is to start the course. You will click on start or continue the course. You will see the information from the platform and then you can just click on start course once you start the course you can basically go to next unit and the first unit is computer basic by gcflearning.org free.org now why we have added this section we received a lot of uh, emails a lot of uh, comments that is there a basic course on this platform now we are very job oriented courses we have all these courses that we have right here are kind of job specific but to kind of help people uh, who are starting from scratch we also provide best information that is available out there and this is one of the most important things that we do is we search for you and that's the main and uh, you know the most important thing in IT is if you find the best information and quality information it saves you time now we have picked specific things that we think you should know we didn't pick every single thing we talked about computers and we basically got the links from the site so when you click on it you will get to the site like this and you can see on the top this is a site and then it will open up um, what you need to learn about computers about this tutorial what is computer basic parts of computers and then you can learn about things very nicely in detail and you can go back and do the same with other basic computer skills, mouse tutorial, typing tutorial, email basics. Then we, then you go a little bit deep into Windows, which is kind of like the operating system people use at work. And then Internet, like you know, they use Chrome, Firefox, Internet Explorer, basics, how to troubleshoot it. Then the same thing with devices and digital skills. So we we kind of searched through it, and we decided that this is what you need to go to the next step. The next step is by Professor Messer, which is technical learning. And I will be very honest to you guys that you guys need to take your time when you come to this section. It is a big section. Now if you look at it, these are playlists. If you click on it, these are 77 videos in this playlist. And what you will learn in this section, you have two sections right here. One is 20, uh, 229.02 and one is 229.01, which is basically preparing you for A plus certification. Not only it prepares you to take our courses like hands-on courses, but it will also prepare you for certification. And it's free. So you can basically learn all this, apply for A plus certification while you're learning everything hands-on from our courses and you're applying to jobs. Now if you get lucky you even land a job without certification without any formal education which people have done this in this platform which I will show you at the end of this video. But the main reason for you to go over this is kind of understanding what technology you're going to be working on and understanding in a way an IT person should be learning. So you're moving from basic computer stuff like mouse, keyboard stuff. Now you're mo moving on to like more of computer stuff, what's inside the computer, RAM, ROM, BIOS, and CPU, sockets, and everything you learn in detail. Professor Mesa videos are great. They are professionally edited, they have a lot of information, some PowerPoint and a lot of lab works in their real work. So you can learn everything and towards certification route. The main focus of this section is that you prepare yourself, your base is so strong that you know the information. When you sit down and you talk to someone about the IT stuff or if you have an interview coming in, you can basically talk about it with confidence after taking this course. Now what this does is that it gives you that information, it gives you that technical learning. Now the next step is getting to the real world and that's your first real world, real world course from this it, which is another course in this platform. You see we did not add videos over here. We have already done this, we have already created a course so it will lead you to take this course from this section which is help this ticketing system. What is ticketing system? Just to give you a basic, when you go you do your work in IT in everywhere you get the job you will have some type of ticketing system or some type of system where you will log all the issues and then you either work on it 
or you assign it to someone else as an entry level IT person most of your job is to work on basic stuff computer related stuff user related stuff and then if it's advanced networking firewall uh, any other things like you know uh, servers then you assign it to someone who have more experience in that specific area so this is what you do you learn that from real world course which is a lot of people don't teach this course and this is the only platform that have a specific course for ticketing system so we teach you on different ticketing systems that's available out there so then you're ready to take on any ticketing systems because they're all almost the same then we go a little bit more in advance we go to Active Directory User Management, which is a very common uh, interview question when you take the interview. Do you know how to add a user? Do you know how to work on Active Directory? This is a very basic question, guys. And over one of the most important videos on our YouTube channel are about Active Directory. So here is another uh, 1,000, and you can see 1,151 students in this course already taking this. And then in this course, you will learn hands-on how we get the ticket we get a ticket remember we talked about tickets so I'm gonna use ticket now in this you will learn that ticketing system you get the ticket from HR they send they send the ticket or an email or somehow they send uh, another way like social uh, the you people now use like a Yammer or social media kind of things they will send a message out that we have a new user through ticketing system you take a, you open the call and now you're going to be adding it by using skills that you know in Active Directory so this is where you learn Active Directory stuff and remember if you're brand new to this video right now you're looking at these terms it will all make sense when you start taking these courses step by step so this is what you do in Active Directory then we have Office 365 and Mr. Ed. this is kind of new technology cloud technology a lot of people call it consider it cloud which is kind of moving most of the companies now they're moving towards cloud and a lot of these uh, you know universities colleges uh, nonprofit sections they're already using Office 365 administrator uh, uh, sorry Office 365 technologies so now before a lot of people would ask you about Active Directory which they still will will do that in interview but now this is going to be an another hot term in interview people are going to be asking you about Office 365 and in this course we teach you everything about Office 365 and you can see there's 819 students already taking this course and the ratings are pretty high then when you finish all this I will tell you one thing that you should be applying for jobs entry-level jobs because at this point you know things you are you have that mind of IT person now you're just getting more better and better you're becoming very technical and for that you take this big course final real world help this entry level to specialist course and in that course you can see we have about 2785 students and this is going very fast a lot of people are joining this course guys so you would what you want to do is once you finish all this you will get to this course which is another big course so my suggestion to you is this when you finish the first three f four sections right here which is going to be very quick um, not the professor Messer side because you can probably skip on some videos to learn but you definitely want to take this first one second one third one and then you want to start applying to jobs while you're taking this course because this is going to prepare you on that technical stuff this is where you will need this type of stuff when you start working so when you start working and somebody say oh we got 80 computers coming tomorrow and you need to uh, deploy it deploy it to all of the users then what do you do then do you just sit down and on that one computer you just sit down and spend one hour 30 minutes by installing the operating system doing updates and everything multiply that one hour 30 uh, minutes one hour and 30 minutes multiply that by 70 80 300 computers and your life will be hell you don't want to do that right so you need to learn something better you need to learn about deployments which can be done in hour in even two three hours or can be done very quickly by using imaging tools and this is what you will see in this course that this is a pretty big course you will take your time and then you will finish it by the end of this course you are an IT person so there shouldn't be any confusion then now th the more you get better and better that's up to you what route you're going to take after this but at this point you are the IT professional because this is what IT people do now a lot of people get very very technical in one specific area or they get better in everything but that's their own personal you know um, approach in IT where they are becoming very very professional I mean very very skillful in this field but 
most of this job is guys to land a job and you will follow it because you will follow your company rules and they will train you on 90 percent of the time they will train you so your part is this you need to start from basic you need to go do the basic stuff you need to learn technical learning from professor messer which you they will give you a strong base and then you need to learn the real hands-on courses from this course by the end what are you going to achieve now is this going to be worth it first of all almost all of this is free learning learning courses all of it's free this is very expensive stuff outside on internet so take an advantage the only time we charge is if you want a certificate or if there's a special course now there's no special course in this learning path all of them are free this certification is not free it's for only membership plus members and it's only cost 1.99 dollars so we we made it that way so people can afford this stuff but what is the outcome of this you can see you can come over here and witness it yourself by clicking on the IT career questions and success stories here people not only they decided to give us a great information that they have landed a job but one of the best information that sometimes they share and I like them to share is when they share their interview questions like this and this is another one landed a job and then they share information landed a job then share information landed a job and share information and it goes on and on and on here Hamza shared his questions IT questions and then here you can see the great success stories by people landing job with no experience IT experience is right here in front of you guys and Lisa actually shared all the IT qu questions that she got in interview and that is very powerful stuff right here so I want you to take advantage of this course this is a very powerful laid out roadmap for you guys and uh, so hopefully this will be a great start for you guys the people who are actually thinking to start from scratch maybe you're coming in after a few months and you need to just kind of brush up and you don't need to go through the basics and you just want to learn from professor Messer and then go on all the way maybe you're a student you are already done this and now you just need a f the the real world courses you can do that you can be in any category you can be in any category starting this course and you can make a success out of this thank you so much and i'll see you guys in a different video